As you knew it had to be coming, it is the new Traxxas release of the TRX4 Mercedes-Benz G63 AMG 6x6. I am telling you, I've looked at this thing tonight online and this will just blow you away with the realism and the features on this thing. Uh, if anybody wondered what Traxxas had waiting in the wings, and I think this is one of only the, the first few cars that they will release this year, uh, wait till you see the, the bigger pictures. Uh, on this as I crawl on through it. Okay, we've got a six-wheel drive platform, fully licensed scale replica of the Mercedes-Benz G63 MG 6x6. These, the real thing of this is about a quarter of a million bucks, I believe. Six drive wheels, 3T locking, uh, 3T lock, remote locking differentials, port axles, high-low transmission, and you're thinking all oh, that's the same as the, maybe in the TRX4, etc. Then you start reading on. Six aluminum long travel shocks, and a stunning accurate body with brilliant LED lighting. So not only has it got the long travel shock kit attached to it, it's got LED lighting included as well. Both of those things on their own run to a couple of hundred bucks a piece. So you get a huge value included in this truck. Anyway, no word on the pricing as yet. Well, I'll talk about that further on in a minute. Just check out the articulation on the truck in that picture there and the classic one of it racing up over the desert but that's nothing compared to the pictures that they have got further on down. Uh, there's a video guys which I will uh, leave you to play through in your own time because YouTube doesn't tend to like you playing other YouTube videos on its uh, video. Now you're looking and you're thinking well that looks okay Rich and it goes on to talk about the spec in a minute but wait till I click on these bigger pictures guys. Are we ready for this? Check this thing out and it gets better. It just looks like the real thing. I'm wondering, like, where the hell's the driver? What are we thinking so far? Thumbs up if you're liking the look of this, guys. And by all means, feel free to share this video with any Traxxas friends. Just check that out. With the lights on that thing, just make it look absolutely stunning. I mean, a brilliant picture with a backdrop on that, but it just has blown me away. More on that chassis in a minute because that is one of the innovations on the car. It's got portal axles all round, as you would uh, have guessed would it been based on a TRX4. It's got the two, sp it's got the high low uh, gearbox, but that looks like all metal gears in there. Three T locking differentials. Now you're thinking, are you able to just lock all three at once, unlock all three at once? You can individually control all three differentials from the transmitter. That's right guys, you can have one locked, you can have two locked, you can have all three locked. You have the front locked, the rear locked, not the middle locked uh, from reading on the spec of this thing. So that is just absolutely outstanding. One of, I think, the best scale looking trucks I have seen in many years. I feel like an off the shelf one for a start on there guys. I think this thing, it's not going to be that cheap, but I do think it's going to sell like hotcakes. Anyway, let me carry on. Just remember guys, if you like what you see today, don't forget to subscribe. Moving down the spec. It says first delivery model shipping now, so we're probably going to see them end of next week, or early next week, end of next week, I would guess. I've already preemptively put an order in for one tonight, guys, because this thing has just blown me away. Um, for various reasons that I'll talk about in a minute, one of the areas that I felt my TRX4 is weak on is when the weight shifts from the front to the back. The back end, unlike some crawl, the back end just seems to lose all traction on very loose stuff. It really, really struggles uh, on there. So the two reels at the rear, to my mind, for the terrain that I'm going over, uh, I think will be a great help on there. Sure, it's not going to be maybe as nimble around turns because it's got a much longer wheelbase. Uh, but for just kind of the fun type crawling that I do, not into competition stuff, I think this will be absolutely excellent. So exceptional body detail, fully licensed uh, Mercedes AMG 63 6x6 body. Uh, this is based on a real car, by the way. If anybody's not seen one of these guys, they are few and far between. Uh, the initial run of them actually sold out. I think it was at the Geneva Motor Show a few years back. Uh, factory equipped LED lighting, so the LED lighting comes as standard on the car guys, no paying 150, 200 bucks for lighting kits fit already. The chassis, 1.5 millimeter uh, steel rails formed in one piece for added strength and you've also got cross bracing on there as well. Ultimate ground clearance, portal axles as you would fully expect with it being based on a TRX4, 
high low range transmission on it so it also says you can do a massive roost and six wheel power slides so it does make you wonder what motor it will come out with because I'm thinking maybe it's going to be something a little bit beefier than the stock TRX4 to take into account the extra torque it's going to need to drive that extra set of wheels on there. I'd say remote locking differentials, this is where I read earlier guys, you can lock and unlock each one individually. As I say, long travel shocks on there, 2.2 beadlock rims on there. So the thing is going to be have a massive ground clearance, it's going to be able to go with that fairly major stuff on there guys. Well, that just about wraps it up. It says more details coming soon. I cannot wait to see this in store, and I think they will be in next week. Anyway, guys, if you like this quick overview of the uh, Traxxas Mercedes-Benz G63 MG 6x6, to give it its full name, then don't forget to subscribe, as yours truly will be getting one of these as soon as he possibly can. Thanks for watching. Well, thumbs up if you like this video, guys. Post any comments you might have in the comment section below the video and hit the circle below to subscribe. And if you do hit the circle, don't forget to hit the bell.